The Meridian Housing Authority is done with the planning phase for the Meridian Youth Build Grant, and they're ready to start training and educating. Now, this grant will cover training and education of more than 80 local disadvantaged at-risk youth ages 16 to 24. In tonight's Skilled to Work, we find out what comes next. The Meridian Housing Authority is prepared to put a big dent in the current skills gap in our community with the help of a Youth Build grant. Youth Build is a youth development program designed to impact the lives of those at-risk youth who have dropped out of school with no type of formal education um, to assist them in getting a GED um, to help them learn a skill and a trade to be able to get them those leadership development skills, those character building skills, and to be able to help them in career pathways um, like construction and give them those skills that they need to be successful. Those selected to participate in the Youth Build program will be educated and trained for free, but there are other incentives as well. With our Youth Build program, we will have three cohort groups, and so each cohort will last approximately eight months. And our participants will come Monday through Friday from 8.30 to 3.30. So not only will they be getting their education, they'll be learning a skill, a trade, going into the classroom on construction sites, working one-on-one -on -one with a mentor, working with a construction trainer. Another exciting thing that we have to offer them is a weekly stipend. So they will be getting paid as they learn. And so we're just looking for the right young people to, to get on the bus, so to speak. Getting paid while you learn, I, I think that's a win-win. Gretchen encourages everyone that meets the eligibility requirements to apply immediately. We're taking applications right now for our upcoming first cohort. So for more information, you can contact us at Meridian Housing Authority at 601-693-4285 or stop by the central office of Meridian Housing Authority and we have applications available. And again, um, the eligibility requirements um, are for low income at-risk um, young people, um, young people um, who have been a part of the foster care system, Child Protective Service, um, Department of Human Services, or those individuals without any high school education, those young people that just need our support. And we believe that they are capable and they have skills already. We just want to help them tap into those skills that they have. Skilled to Work is a Twin States news initiative brought to you by our community partners.